what's up guys welcome to another video happy to have you on here today we're going to be looking at another library javascript library and today we're going to be looking at the react date picker so a date picker allows you to select a date quite easily and we definitely need those in a lot of projects we want to maybe get a feedback or an input from the user maybe on his date of birth or maybe on a particular timeline he's trying to select and so you need a library like this to be able to help you do that easily definitely you can implement this maybe with some different selects or you can program this yourself but it's quite easier to just have a library which is going to allow you to have that functionality and so let's just check out how this works easily so it's called react date picker and you can check it at reactdatepicker.com quite easily the installation just a couple of lines you can have it on there and so here you have some examples of the different options you can go with so you have maybe the default date picker you can go for once the user selects this not only can he write directly into the the box but he can select it graphically you know if you want to select a date you can say go through all of the calendar and select the date you know so he goes ahead and selects the date and so on and so forth so if he doesn't want to do all the selection and all he can definitely type it respecting the format and it's going to show up just as it, it should you know it's going to select the date as it should look so as you see i've just typed it a date out and then it has gone to that date on the calendar and that's just it so it's just a simple library amazing with a lot of options so maybe you check out another example if you want to have an icon there on the left side on the right side maybe an icon of a calendar just to add some more visual representation so you can do that as well um, calendar container so if you want to add maybe a border with colors and so on you can do just that and so check out make sure you notice that this the customization is done by you like you can add the styles and everything by yourself so see it's added what is your favorite day at the top and he has a whole border which is blue yeah so if you want a calendar open state callbacks that's it like if you want to call a function maybe after the user opens and closes the calendar you can do that as well and so children options like don't forget to check the weather and so on and so forth so it has kind of a lot of options and there are so so many examples <laughs> we are definitely not going to check all of those it's a simple calendar even though this design of a button isn't the best i mean people have to know it's an input where you get to select the date not just a button that you click but i guess if this is needed in the project it can also work as well so you can go ahead and select um this if you want to put the drop the, the, the menu is inside a drop down instead that's better this helps you maybe select a particular range of dates or a particular period instead than just putting everything in there at once so yeah so as you can see those are the lines of code you need to do those not complicated quite easy to do so you can just copy them from here and just put them into your code custom date class name custom date format like if you don't like the default date format you can easily change it it works too custom time inputs if you want a calendar and the time like it allows you to do that a date range if you want to select two between two dates you can go ahead and do that just duplicate it if you directly even want to have the calendar on there you don't want to have any input you just want to have a calendar you can do that as well like this allows you to select the date range instantly <laughs> it's just amazing the way it works you know so it's kind of easy like just a couple of lines and you have this implemented so as you can see the scroll is not even at the middle there are still so so many other options to check out we are definitely not going to check them all out today but i just want to present to you this simple library javascript library you should definitely check it out it allows you to have a very customizable calendar which allows your users to select a date and give you that feedback so definitely check out this amazing react date picker um library i'm not really sure if it's customizable like if the interface is customizable it doesn't look like it is but with all the customization i see already i hope it's you're able to customize this interface because right now it looks like way too small and way too uncolorful so it'd be so sad if you can't customize that as well but you should definitely check it out it's going to allow you to to input dates amazingly so i hope you enjoy the video catch you on the next one.